Good morning guys. I've been wanting to do a review on this Miller Spoolmate um, spool gun. And uh, this is the Spoolmate, there it is, 100. It's aluminum fed and I want to tell you, I was very shocked by this gun. I had used uh, spool guns before and um, and I'll tell you I wasn't real used to using them first of all and so I'm going to tell you some of the techniques uh, of doing this now I, I got this hooked on to the Miller Multimatic 200 and I just got it set on MIG I got 0 .30 wire I'm one eighth material and it's on the auto set feature so the wire feed and the speed and the voltage is already set so we're going to weld some of this up and you, if you want to look at some of the welds I've already done with it it's just incredible how good it welds. So I'm going to go ahead and let's see uh, let's see what I can do here with this machine and see what you think. All right, guys, let's put a little weld right here. We're going to see how it does. Now, one of the things I like to do is I got a little wire brush here. Just cleans it up a little bit. Now I'm going All right, guys, I already cleaned this up a little bit. And uh, so what I'm going to do here, I'm just going to run a bead across here. And again, just to let you know, when you weld with this, uh, they some say you can push and pull. I found out it's a lot better to push. And what happens is you want to hold this about 15 degrees and push your wire this direction. Now, I tried it pulling. It does work. What I've noticed, it seems like the the gas uh, doesn't flood the area quite as good so just keep that in mind I'm not saying it can't be done and uh, so forth and maybe it's the difference in guns and so forth you know I don't know but uh, let's go ahead and run a beat here let's see what it looks like always helps to hook on the ground There you have it. And uh, again, like I said, well, it's really nice. Clean that up a little bit. The wire brush looks pretty good. Well, I hope this uh, video helps you. Uh, it's a good little gun. I was able to build everything out with with just this, all out of aluminum. Now, I will tell you, this gun does have some limitations. For example, uh, this is the 100. It's not considered a heavy duty gun at all. It only runs 0 .030 wire and it only runs 4043. So keep that in mind. Uh, they do sell other guns, spool guns, bigger, heavier duty, that you can also purchase too. But uh, I hope this helps you if you're looking for one and you're getting into aluminum. This is definitely a uh, gun that will get the job done.